Ladies and gentlemen, our next contest this evening is four three-minute rounds in the Cruiserweight division. Firstly, please welcome, wearing the red and black shorts, weighing in 13 stone, 11 pounds, fighting out of the red corner from Battersea, London. Please welcome Nick Akoff. And across the ring, his opponent this evening, fighting out of the blue corner, wearing the blue and silver shorts, weighing in 14 stone, three pounds. Please welcome, making his professional debut this evening, from Edinburgh, Stephen Simmons. Your referee in charge of the action is Kenny Pringle from Hamilton, who will now give his final instructions to both boxers. Hey boys. Hey boys, you both know the score. Listen to all times, defend yourself all times. Touch gloves and get to work. Ladies and gentlemen, four three minute rounds. Pro debut this for Steve Simmons. One of Scotland's top amateurs. Now makes his bow in the professional ranks against Nick Akoth. He came into the ring with a, a t shirt on saying London's fittest firefighter 2006. Let's hope he's still in good shape. Colin Hart, who joins me ringside. It would help if I put my microphone on, wouldn't it? Um, well, it's going to be interesting. Uh, every fighter who makes a debut um, must have a load of butterflies in their stomach coming out the amateurs. That, uh, so it's going to be interesting to see how Simmons reacts. He won a bronze at the Commonwealth Games. Commonwealth Games just gone, 2010. Successful one for Scotland because uh, Callum Johnson won gold. He's on the card tonight as well. He doesn't look a huge cruiserweight, does he, Simmons? No. Um, he's well inside the cruiserweight limit, isn't he? At 14-3. But then, of course, he might be one of those unfortunates. Much too big for a light heavyweight. And perhaps not quite big enough for cruiserweights as he gets on. I don't know. He'll fill out a bit, I suppose. And... Uh, with the right diet, they put on a bit of weight without losing fitness. And I think um, light heavy's 12-7. Uh, so he's got only two stones. So he's got a good body shot there from Simmons. Yeah, I know. Okay. that. Yeah, he backs off. And he's told to, to keep his shot up. With a low one there. The crowd are enjoying this. Well, I always like seeing Scotts and beat up Londoners. Koth has had uh, nearly 50 pro fights, 10 wins, 32 losses, 5 draws as well. So he knows his way around, he's trapped in the corner now. And Simmons can uh, sense an early night here. That's a positive start this from him. And Koth catches in with one. more intensity to this one than the uh, the first fight we saw this evening well Simmons seems to be intent on getting him out of there as quickly as possible which of course pleases the crowd a decent opening round this well, there's no doubting who won that round that was, uh, Mr. Simmons by a distance he comes out of this uh, ever-growing Billy Nelson stable. There's here Nelson in the corner there. Of course, uh, trains Ricky Burns. He's been around for a while, Billy Nelson. Remember being in the corner with uh, Peter Harrison when, when Scott Harrison was a world champion. Dean Powell's in the corner too with, uh, with Simmons. The best of the action from the Opening yeah. round. Yeah. But don't have your elbows out here and don't look at the referee to give you help. Okay, it's now you, it's down to you. Make another drink. 
I'll well, stand to you now. You need to stuff in your jam, Dr. Hal, right? It's okay. You hear me? Thank you. Here we go. Again, a lively start to this second round. Now, oh, Cothy's uh, just trying to tie Simmons up, make it a little bit messy. There's a cut somewhere. There's some blood around. Uh, Gumshield's come out. Yeah, Cost Gumshield has come out as well. I'm quite sure where this blood is from. There's some on the uh, uh, forehead of um, Simmons, and there's. Um, oh, Cost seems to be having a long word with his corner then as the Gumshield went back in. The name of the Ox. It's emblazoned on the back of his shorts. He's kind of got the bullish head forward style of one as well. I don't know if the just hurt here. There's blood streaming from his nose. That's where the, uh, the blood is coming from. He's in a bit of trouble here. Backed into the ropes. I think the referee's about to step in here. He's taking. He is. Good spot, Colin. Yeah, quite right. Totally out punched, and a good start for Young Simmons. That will give him plenty of confidence as he marches on to what he, we hope will be a successful career. I wonder if uh, I think a cost. His nose uh, nose went there. Sort of shook his head when the referee stopped it, but I it looked more out of a, a sense that he didn't really know what to do. He was disappointed with the stoppage. Well, he w I think the referee did him a favour, didn't he? Showed he the, showed the public he was disappointed, but I bet inwardly he thinks, thanks very much, ref, because it was one way traffic. Let's see in the finish back here. It's good from Simmons. The sense that had his man in trouble, and he really went for it. We're about to join our MC Mark Burris for official confirmation of the stoppage. Both fighters have uh, come to the centre of the ring. Hands being held by um, referee Kenny Pringle. Billy Nelson with a smile on his face in the corner. A successful uh, first fight of the evening for him. He'll go off and uh, help prepare Ricky Burns now. Ladies and gentlemen, at 1 minute 36 seconds of round two, your referee has stopped the contest. He deems that Nikikov was in no position to continue. The winner is the blue corner from Edinburgh, Scotland, Stephen Simmons. Ladies and gentlemen, a round of applause for the girl, Nikikov.